Team calendars can now dynamically spin up Zoom links with the new Zoom integration. To get started, head to your Profile tab, scroll to the bottom, and in the Integrations area, click Connect. You'll get a pop-up where you'll have to accept some permissions, and then once you do, you'll see your Zoom account email ID here. Now, if you want all of your bookings to automatically use a dynamic link, you can scroll up into your user availability section and change your meeting location to Zoom and then hit update availability and you'll get this prompt saying your meeting location just got updated. Do you want to overwrite the meeting location in all calendars that you've been a part of? So if you wanna use dynamic links across the board, go ahead and hit okay. If not, you can hit cancel and you can go to your calendar settings And here, next to your name, you'll be able to choose a location from Zoom. Once you select Zoom, you'll see the meeting location gray out because that's going to dynamically populate with a Zoom meeting link. Just scroll down and hit Save. You can then close your calendar and open the calendar on the front end to test it out. If I make a booking here for Bob Smith, we can see on the confirmation page that a dynamic Zoom link was spun up and if we head over to scheduling calendar and we open Bob's appointment, we'll also see that Zoom link that was created there in the meeting location. Also note that in your calendar settings, on the confirmation tab, you can also use the custom value for appointment meeting location, and that will dynamically populate the link that was generated. So it pushes through into the meeting notes, for example, so you'll see it in your Google Calendar booking.